my baby Got me staring at you So I'm crazy Won't you bend that back for me We won't stop Got your feet both locked You get to fly with me Hey everyone, today I thought I would film an updated nighttime routine because I haven't done one of these since I've moved back into my family's house. If you guys have been following me for a while then you would know that last year I was living out of home in my own apartment and then I recently moved back in with my family and so my whole routine has kind of changed up. I've done an updated morning routine but I haven't showed you guys my nighttime routine so that's what I'm going to be doing today. I guess like a few things have changed but a few things have stayed the same but today has been a very chill day as you guys can tell because I'm wearing my Udi this is literally what I've been wearing on a daily basis I've got an avocado one and then this pink one and it's just like sitting in a big marshmallow so you'll probably see me wearing this like half the time throughout this video if you guys haven't seen an Udi before this is what it looks like it's basically a massive blanket that you can actually wear and it's so soft and warm and it's got a hood so it can keep your ears warm and also it's so huge that if you just like sit down and bend your knees you can literally cover all of your legs so you can be literally wrapped up which is so nice so I've been wearing this non-stop it's really soft on the inside as you can see and then obviously it's soft on the outside as well and it's also got this big kangaroo pocket here so you can chuck your stuff in your pocket and walk around your house I like to chuck my journal in my little pocket in the morning and then I'll head downstairs and do my morning routine and yeah, it's just kind of handy. So I just think an Udi is a really convenient thing to have, especially if you're indecisive and you don't know what to wear, then you can just like chuck this on and you're good to go. I'll link it down below for you guys to check out, but I also have a discount code that you can use. So if you use the code Ella, it will give you $30 off any Udi that you would like to pick. There are so many different designs, like Literally, think of something that you're interested in and they'll probably have an Udi with that design on it. So if you like French Bulldogs, they have an Udi for French Bulldogs. If you like pizza, they have an Udi for pizza. So literally there's everything, but go check it out. I'll link it down below. Anyway, I now need to get unready for the day and get all clean. I need to wash my hair tonight and wash my face. Just do all of the stuff that I do in the shower. <laughs> Butterflies are floating like your red hair in the breeze. I am feeling so much fresher. As you saw, I washed my hair and blow dried it with my Dyson hair dryer. I have had a few of you guys ask me what I think of the Dyson hair dryer since I got it for my birthday, and I absolutely love it. I feel like my hair has also been loving it. As you know, I chopped it off a few months ago and it, honestly, I chopped it to about here and it's grown back so, so much. And so I feel like it's just causing a lot less damage to my hair and it also makes it so shiny and soft. So I love it. Also, you might've seen that I use this Dermaveen moisturizer on my face and this is for eczema. And randomly, I've been getting some eczema on my face, especially on my eyelid and on my cheeks, which is so rare for me. So I've been using this lately to try and like hydrate my skin because it's just so weird. Like I had eczema as a kid, but it's just come back now. I think I can smell dinner. This has been the best thing since moving back home. My mom cooks dinner which is so so nice I try and help where I can but I wasn't the best cook anyway so I've been loving eating my mum's meals and she's also studying nutrition so she makes nice healthy dinners so yeah I'm gonna go have dinner so mom has made some homemade pumpkin soup for dinner which sounds so yum so I'm just gonna sit here and eat my dinner No, this is wrong, so why do we carry this on in the air? Sorry, Murphy? Say it again? <laughs> He's so funny. Look who's here. Hello, Just got to my house. 
<laughs> the next thing that I like to do when I come back up to my room is just kind of like set the mood So I'll go around and turn my LED lights on my fairy lights light some candles put my diffuser on What color are you feeling tonight? I'm gonna put the red LED light on because it's better for your eyes because if you have like white light and blue light Exposure to your eyes before you go to bed. It's not very good because it wakes you up so <laughs> using red light is really good because it just kind of Make sure I settle down. So that's what I like to do. I actually don't know the science behind that or anything. I just read that somewhere. It's like, so if you see red light instead of like white light, when you turn the lights off, you should still be able to see in the dark. That's not and very exciting. It's not worth it for me. I don't care oh about that. God. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so yeah, I'm going to go and make my room feel nice and cozy. The room is looking so much cozier and Brayden's like, Ella, I'm just going to go to the toilet while you do that. And I was thinking, oh, it's taking a while, definitely doing a poo. Um, <laughs> anyway, he comes back with Sanchuros. It's been a little bit of a thing that Brayden and I have been doing lately. We've been getting Sanchuros, especially when I've been like having a bad day. Like Brayden just knows how to make my day and I wasn't really having a very good day today and... Yeah, there's nothing that Sanchiro's and a bit of cookie butter can't fix. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so, so good, guys. And it's also vegan. Not that I'm vegan, but somehow it makes me feel like it's healthier when it's actually not. It's still full of sugar. Not healthy. Yeah, it's so... Oh, the cookie butter is so good. All right, so now is that time in the night where either I'll watch something on Netflix with Brayden or we'll just, like, hang out. Or if I'm not with Brayden, I'll watch my own show. And lately I've been watching Gossip Girl. But yeah, that's what I've been binge watching lately. I'm so late to the party. But yeah, Brayden and I will usually watch a comedy or something. What do you want to watch tonight? I sort of want to start a new series with you, but I don't know. Yeah. Let us know in the comments what are some good Netflix or Stan series. Like something that you can watch with your partner. Because I feel like Brayden and I usually like very different things. Yeah. He likes more crime and I like more comedy and rom-com. Mm. That's my vibe. We'll let you know what we decide on. We're going to watch The 40-Year-Old Virgin and eat our churros. Brayden has now left my house and I'm getting ready to go to sleep so I've just brushed my teeth and got some clothes out ready for tomorrow morning because I'm going to get up early tomorrow and I'm going to go to 5.30 club. I haven't been going to 5.30 club lately. I've been doing kind of my whole routine in the morning from home but I feel like I want to change things up again and get back into the routine of going especially since it's starting to warm up and the sun's coming up a little bit earlier. I think it'll be really nice. So I'm going to try that again tomorrow and see how I go. But obviously that means I have to get up quite early. So I need to go to sleep a little bit earlier. So I make sure that I'm in bed before 10 p.m. if I'm getting up at 5 a.m. So now I'm just going to set my alarms. And I want to show you guys my alarm that my mom recently got me. It is honestly so, so cool. It's a alarm slash diffuser slash LED light and it's so cool because you can actually set your LED light to come on really gradually so that when your alarm goes off your room is filled with natural lighting so this is amazing when you wake up really early like me and it's pitch black outside and it just confuses you and you feel like oh I want to go back to sleep because it's not morning time because it's dark outside so it's so useful for that so this is it it's from dusk and it's really cool because it has like a bunch of different sounds that you can play I really like this one because it's the sound of birds but they have a bunch of different ones so you can also wake up to the sound of the ocean as you can hear and then the light can go really really bright so that it's like natural daylight sorry to blind you guys but i just wanted to show you what i meant and you can also change the led light to different colors but i really like the white one obviously going to set my alarm for 5 15 so that my light is fully on at quarter past five and the last thing that i'm going to do tonight before i go to bed is some journaling i'm going to write my to-do list for tomorrow and just kind of 
reflect on my day and just write down whatever I want really. I really believe in the saying that a successful day starts the night before. I think that's the saying but you know what I mean and it's so true. I find that if I spend time the night before planning out my day and writing out my intentions and just getting like a clear idea of how I want my day to go, it just helps so so much especially since I'm self-employed and I need a bit more structure and discipline so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna write out what I'm doing tomorrow and yeah this just really helps me now that I finished my journaling I'm just gonna go straight to sleep but I hope you guys enjoyed watching this little nighttime routine a few things are different now that I've moved back into my family's house but I really like my routine that I've been doing lately I feel like it's been helping me wind down and sleep a lot better because I've been prioritizing a lot of self-care and just doing a few rituals that just signal to me that oh, it's time for bed, you know? Like, just putting like my LED light on just makes me feel so much more relaxed. And I'm like, okay, it's time to wind down and go to sleep. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.